Hello guys and welcome back to Treasure Digital. If your Discord is stuck on the starting screen, it can be quite frustrating. Here are some steps you can try to resolve the issue of Discord stuck on starting screen. 1. Restart Discord. Discord just needs a simple restart. Close the Discord application completely and then open it again. 2. Check for updates. Ensure that you're running the latest version of Discord. 3. Check your internet connection. Ensure that your internet connection is stable and working properly. 4. Use the web version. If the desktop application is giving you trouble, try using Discord in your web browser. 6. Check for Discord server issues. Sometimes Discord itself may experience server issues. You can check the status of the Discord servers on their status page. Disable VPN or proxy. If you're using a VPN or a proxy server, try disabling it and see if Discord starts. Check firewall and antivirus settings. Your firewall or antivirus software may be blocking Discord. Ask, check if Discord is allowed to access the internet, you may need to add Discord to your firewalls exception list. Clear Discord cache. Clearing Discord's cache may help resolve the various issues. To do this, close Discord, type Windows plus R, type app data and hit enter. Locate the Discord folder, right click on it and select delete. Reinstall Discord. If it all fails, you can reinstall Discord, restart your computer, and then reinstall it. This should resolve any issues related to corrupted files or settings. Run as an administrator. Right click on the Discord shortcut and choose Run as an administrator. This can help in case Discord is facing permission issues. Check for third party software conflicts. Some third-party software like overlays and recording software can conflict with Discord. And of course, if none of the above solutions work, you may need to contact Discord support team for further assistance. Remember to restart your computer after making changes to ensure that they take effect. If the problem persists, it may be a more complex issues. You should contact Discord support for specific guidance and of course and for sure they are will do their best to help you resolve your issue i hope this video was helpful for you guys thank you guys for watching and see you on the next video